so right here, what I'm testing is uh, some general electrical tape um, that you might find at a hardware store. Um, this is Scotch. So uh, uh, Scotch may be our customer and they would uh, contact us and they are interested in knowing the force it takes to pop or break their electrical tape. Uh, so what we'll do is we'll provide them with a solution uh, and this would be a good one for them. It's a force test stand, so I've got um, a sample of electrical tape mounted here, and uh, so we'll run the test. All right, so you'll see right here it broke at 12 pounds of force. Um, their quality department will uh, spec this out. They will uh, find what's acceptable and what's not. Uh, so generally uh, today it's been 12 pounds. So they might have a target of 13 or 11. If it's over, it's too strong. If it's under, it's too weak. Of course, they don't want that to hit the market and uh, people to be buying it and, and it and it'd be too strong or too weak. So this is a way for them to uh, test as they're manufacturing and if they find that their product is out of spec then they can start looking back uh, at their manufacturing processes they might contact their raw material suppliers uh, they might look at their blending application uh, that makes up the compounds of this so uh, there's a wide range of um, investigation they can do but it all kind of starts at this machine that tells them the strength of their tape